out-of-state investors, if you're thinking about investing in a market like Cleveland, I don't want you to do anything until you watch today's show. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey, everyone. Welcome to another episode of the MLS Search Analysis Show. You're watching Holton Wise TV, and I'm your host, James Wise. And I think it's incredibly important for out-of-state investors to watch this show. Now, obviously, it's my show. Of course, I want you to watch the show. But, guys, I'm serious here. Look, a lot of people think that there's only one way to invest out-of-state, and that is to go with, like, a traditional turnkey company where they buy the property, they renovate the property, they put a tenant in the property, then they sell it to you. Now, that sounds cool. That sounds great. That's super fancy, super easy. That's slick, right? We provide that type of service as well, but where we go above and beyond that and where we could really help investors like you is – this part right here, all that stuff, it sounds great, but what you're forgetting is if I am the owner of the property, every dollar I discount off of that property is a dollar I lose. So every dollar you make is a dollar I lose. Every dollar I make is a dollar you lose, right? Our our goals, we're not exactly in line, right? The buyer wants to get the property for the best price. The seller wants to get the property for the best price. Their best price and your best price are on opposite sides of the spectrum, Okay. That's where Holton Wise comes in. We help investors like you. If you want to go that pure turn turnkey route, we got inventory, right? Check the investment properties for sale show also here on Holton Wise TV. We could do it that way. But if you come here to this show, what you get to do is you get to hire me to put together that turnkey service. But I'm on your team. I'm on your side. And this property right here, this is a property that my man Tim, Tim from California, you want me to to give you uh, the rundown on this particular property, right? So I am here working for you and you alone on this particular property. You are not the first guy that uh, has been interested in this property because this property makes sense from a financial standpoint from afar. So the first thing I want you to do, Tim, is I want you to see my original analysis of this property. Now, this particular property, it, it's on the fringe, okay, of a, of a B neighborhood and like a C neighborhood, okay? Let me pull up the map for you first, right? Because neighborhood is very important to you. So I want to be as transparent as I possibly can about neighborhoods. Now, if we're talking the Cleveland area, up in here, Edgewater, okay, Edgewater, Edgewater Hill, uh, Hill, Detroit Shoreway, right? This is like an A-grade neighborhood, a lot of gentrification, nice B-A stuff here. This whole area right here, like right up in here, this is like C, okay? We got some D stuff up in here. So you're like literally kind of like you know, in between all of it, right? Bird Town, this is probably like a CB, okay? So you're like kind of on the fringe. You're kind of on the outskirts, right? It's very street by street, right? You're kind of right in the middle, right? So I want to make sure that's very clear for you, right? This particular neighborhood, you know, as time goes on, it could prob probably sway one way or the other, right? So I need you to understand that going into this. I don't want uh, to, to, to sell you something, uh, that wasn't what you're expecting, right? The address, 2209 West 101st, Cleveland, Ohio, 44102. It's been on the market a little over a month. They listed it at 100000 The thing I love about this property, though, it's a side-by-side -side duplex. Now, anybody who's watched my shows uh, for any amount of time, they, they know I love the side-by-side -side duplexes more than the up-down duplexes. Up-down duplexes are the majority of the duplexes here in the Cleveland market, right? I would guesstimate like 90% of the duplexes built are up-down. Side-by-side, fewer and further between. Whenever you get the opportunity to bid on them, I always want to take them down because when you have a side-by-side -side duplex, A, the units are typically bigger, more rent, right? Tenants are happier. B, they are not living above or below each other. They're not fighting as much. They're, they're better built usually, so you get lower turnover. Hey lenders, are you looking for more clients? If so, send us an email at sales at holtonwise.com. 
turnover is what kills our return as real estate investors. So this one, nice side-by-side -side layout. Now, it's going to need some work, man. But that's cool. You came to me wanting to do the bird deal, right? We got to do unit turns in each of these. And these things haven't been updated in forever, right? So we got to do the whole shebang. The, the, the mechanicals here are pretty decent, though, right? Updated electrical. These both look to be, you know, fine and operational, probably somewhere I would guess mid-life, okay? Furnaces, they last 30 years, cost 3 Gs to replace, just so everybody knows. Hot water tanks, they last 15, cost a G to replace, right? So we're really only going to need to spend our money upgrading each of these units, right? So I would say we're probably going to do full upgrades in each of these units. What we're going to do, refinish all those hardwood floors, paint all the walls agreeable gray, paint all the trim white, upgrade the kitchen, upgrade the bath, put a vinyl allure flooring in the kitchen and the bath. The rest of the units will be the wood, right? And then we're going to have Home Depot or Lowe's quality fixtures in kitchen and bath. We should be able to do that for approximately 15 k per unit, right? So we'd be all into the Reno for 30 k As far as price goes, I think 100 is too high. I'd like to see you pay 85 bringing you all in at 115 for that 115,000 what are you going to get well you're going to be able to rent each of those units to section 8 tenants for 875 a pop right 1750 a month 21k a year of that 21k a year i anticipate we're going to spend approximately 11 of it right at your $115,000 investment it makes it a 96 cap and I think the bank will probably refinance that. They will probably appraise that for about 10k more, right? So about $125,000. Now, if you waited longer and we saw some gentrification uh, and, and, you know, we got some overflow coming south from the Edgewater area, that'd be great. It'd probably go even higher, right? But don't forget, you're still pretty close to the Denison area. Uh, so you, you got to, you know, you got to bear that in mind when you're uh, thinking about making this investment, okay? So with all that said, though, I think 125 k is what it probably appraised for now after we did that uh, cosmetic turn. That, my friend, would be a 20.1% cash-on-cash return. All right, Tim, welcome back. So in that financial analysis, I think this property listed at a hundo should be sold for 85k right and this is where it's cool right this is where you get that one-on-one -on -one experience where i'm working for you i'm not working for the seller i'm not in their corner right i'm i'm on your team i'm on team tim okay my previous client did not want to pay more than 85 went through got an inspection and was like dude 85 is it not paying a penny more than 85 i have that inspection report tim i will send that to you uh as well but the sellers were like, no, not going to happen. We're not going to sell it for a penny less than 100 As a matter of fact, we may just pull the thing off the market and uh, remove the tenants, try to clean it up, maybe go back to the market. Maybe we'll get more money that way. Now, I don't really think they will get more money doing that. I think the value is actually going to go down if they do that. But here's the thing. Not every seller is a professional in this game. Not every seller understands how rental properties work. Most realtors, like the realtor they hired, are used to working with owner-occupied folks, right? They're not in the investment space, right? So where we're at, Tim, I know for a fact these people have no interest in 85K. I have the inspection report, which you will have the opportunity as you're watching this video to review that big old inspection report. I see no major flags uh, to make me want you to run away from this deal, but know that if you want to take the deal down, you'd have to pay 100K. I'm wishy-washy on whether or not you should pay 100K. I liked it a lot at 85. I don't like it as much at 100. But what I do like about it quite a bit is each of those units are three beds, one bath, right? So uh, it's not often you get those three bed, one baths, right? So for the long term, that's really great rent. But you're going to have to pay a premium for it, Tim. You're going to have to pay 100 is what it sounds like. Now, if you want me to write up an offer lower, you know, my guy wouldn't go above 85. These people are saying we're not taking anything under 100. But, hey, who knows? Maybe if we shoot them like 92, they might change their tune. People have a way of changing what they're saying once you actually put the money in their hand. But I'm going to leave that up to you, Tim. Do I think it's the best deal in the world if you buy it at 100? No. Do I think it's the worst deal in the world if you buy it at 100? No. So with all that said, Tim, I'm going to leave the ball in your court. You tell me what you want to do. I will submit any offer you like. Everybody else, if you're interested in working with me in the same way Tim has been doing, send an email to my team, sales at holtonweiss.com. Include your phone number. We'll walk you through the process of getting started. And as for you, Tim, in addition to this, you sent me one more property, which I'm going to film for you right now. 
Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.